Aldo Varga with Pro Holistic Care Channel. Today I want to talk about two ways, two ways that uh, you can measure how healthy you are. And let me go right away. Let's start with this one. The first one, the first one is that you should always measure how healthy you are in the things you do to stay healthy. Meaning you can just, I'm going to accomplish, you can decide, I'm going to accomplish to drink eight and six and 30 ounces of water a day. I'm going to sleep seven hours a day. I want to make sure that I have good community, good friends that make me happy and excited. I want to make sure that, um, that I am educating myself to stay healthy. I want to make sure I exercise four hours a week. There's so many things that you can do that you know are healthy for you. And then you can use the number two, which is the parameters. How you can measure your health is improving. Because at the end of the day, you cannot measure your health in the way you feel and look. You have to have something that you can measure tangible that you can remeasure and see that things are improving. With that said, that's how we evaluate patients in our office, from the physical evaluation to the blood work evaluation. So what we look into determine what is up in regard, in relation to healthy individual and how we can improve these measurements. And when we improve them, we know with certainty and science that you are getting healthy. So the second one is parameter. Parameter is so that you can measure and remeasure in regard to your health. So number one parameter that I wanted to measure is take a picture of your side, standing normal on your side, and take a picture on your front and look at your posture. As your shoulder move forward, is your neck forward, your here in front of the, of the shoulder, is your shoulder sideways, your pelvic up. You, you look for those ones and you know the in the long term, your health is going to be compromised because your nervous system, your spine, is directly related to organs. As the posture change, you put stress in your nerve and you put stress in your organs and that will make you healthy in the long term. So it's very important to maintain good posture. That's what we do with chiropractic in our office and the rehab. We look at the posture, not with pain, at the posture. Eventually, bad posture will give you pain. So number two, parameter number two, measure your waist as a rule of thumb and an average and this is minor fit to everybody because some bodies are bigger than others but as an average a female should have a waist less than 40 inches and a male should have a waist less than 35 inches i'm sorry i'm sorry i apologize the opposite a male less than 40 inches and a female less than 35 inches measure your waist in the largest portion of work in a way that you can decrease that number right there because that is one of the measurements that puts you in risk to develop metabolic disorder. With those one, the common one are cardiovascular problem, um, diabetes, Alzheimer, and stroke. So you wanna avoid those ones. So let's work with that one. That's something you can measure weekly or monthly because at the end of the day, weight is not a good parameter. There's so many things that can affect the weight on a daily basis that is not a good parameter. Measure your weight is a very good one. Number three, take your, pul your pulse. You can find everywhere in the internet how you take your pulse. But a pulse less than 70 is essential because your heart is relaxing and pulsing the proper way. So that way you can measure how your cardiovascular system is doing. And by doing cardio or doing a metabolic exercise that I show you tomorrow, I'm gonna to put a video of so abdominal routine. You can decrease that pulse. And by decreasing that pulse, you know that you are strengthening your cardiovascular system. So at ProHolistic Care, we do measure for the first evaluation, we'll give you a score A, B, C, D, or F with measurement, with parameter that we improve them. And that score improves, you see you starting at F and improves to a C. We know with science that your health is improving. At the same time, when we do the therapeutic nutrition, the block work, the functional medicine, same thing. We um, evaluate you against healthy individual. We look at your deficiencies, and when we retest, we can see in paper that these are improving, and we know that you're getting healthy. So that's my message today, Dr. Ricardo Varga with Pro Holistic Care Channel. Use these three measurements to improve your health. Contact us for more help. Let's improve your health so you can live a happy, healthy, fun life. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you, you share this with your friends and family and community. Let's Let's make this life an uh, awesome life because we are feel awesome and healthy. Dr. Ricardo Vargas, talk to you soon.